This next video is all about how to claim your website on Pinterest. So you've created a business account, now what do you do? Well, you can click this button that says claim your website and there's a few different ways to get to this place. But basically, you might notice this looks a lot like our, our settings area because that's what it is. So we're gonna go to our settings area and scroll down to claim your website. So I've got my website here. I'm gonna go ahead and make sure that I have my HTTPS added. So if you are HTTP or HTTPS, so I'm gonna go ahead and click claim. And now it's gonna ask me two different options. The easiest option is add HTML tag. So I'm gonna to wanna to copy this, but before I do that, I need to do some stuff to my website. So I'm gonna go over here to plugins, installed plugins. If I did not already have the insert headers and footers plugin on my site, I would go here to add plugins and then I would search for insert headers and footers here in the keywords and then install that plugin. Once it's installed, you're gonna to wanna to activate it and then you're gonna go over here to the installed plugins tab to make sure that it is activated. So here, mine's already activated. So I would have to click like that activate button to activate it. Once you have the insert headers and footers plugin installed and activated, which you'll wanna activate it here from installed plugins, then you're going to access it from the area called settings and you'll scroll down to insert headers and footers. Now I already have some data in here for my Google Analytics setup. That's a totally different video. Um, and if you are interested in that, click the I button up here on the right hand side to get the link to a video on how to install Google Analytics on your WordPress site. Now, if you're on Blogger or Squarespace or another platform, I'm sorry, I don't have a tutorial for you on this right now. Um, and that's just because I, I have a Blogger site, but I don't really use it and I don't use Squarespace. So um, I'm sure that there are tons of people here on YouTube that can give you some tutorials for those platforms that specialize in those platforms. And I think they would be the best people to hear about this kind of stuff from. Go back over to Pinterest. I want to copy this HTML tag. So I'm just going to highlight the whole thing and click Control C or if you're on a Mac, Command C to copy. I'm going to go over here into my header script. And what I want to do is paste this in here. Doesn't look like much, but that's all you gotta do and click save. Once it's saved, I'm gonna click the next button over here on Pinterest and click submit for review. So now they're gonna tell me whether or not they can claim my website. And what this is gonna do is it's going to help me get attribution and analytics for all my content that's on Pinterest. So what happens is once your website is claimed, somebody pinned this from Most Beautiful Things, this lady, Jessie, and we don't know who Jessie is, but Jesse pinned it to Pinterest, but it keeps all this information about the original person that created it once you've claimed your website. So I can access their website from here, I can follow them from here, even though they didn't pin this actual pin. So that's why claiming your website is so super duper powerful. If you thought that this video was helpful to you, you have some friends that have businesses, etc. please tag them in the comments, hit the share button, share this on social media, send them a tweet. Sharing is absolutely caring and I really appreciate it if you guys would share my videos with them because if it helped you, it probably would help them. All right, I thank you so much for watching and I will see you in the next video, bye.